Growing up, my parents were always like, you will always work hard, leave it on the field. If I'm gonna do it, I have to do it to my best ability. Otherwise, why am I doing it? How do I be the best teammate to my teammates? How do I grow and be better for them? That was beautiful, guys. What makes me a game changer is the attitude I bring. I can be fun and goofy in the locker room, but as soon as I get on the field, I'm ready to attack the game. Hi, I'm Kelly Hubley, a defender for the Portland Thorns, and I'm a game changer. In college, I was diagnosed with Graves' disease, which is an autoimmune disorder. I really couldn't work out. I would shake and I thought I had anxiety, but it was actually just like my heart was racing so fast. I had to take like a year off of soccer completely. I ended up having surgery to remove the whole thyroid. And as soon as I woke up from surgery, my resting heart rate went automatically down to 72. I just started feeling like myself again and like being the player. Deep down, I knew I could have been. So I was like, I'll just try to go pro. I didn't get drafted, but Portland just called and they said, if you want to come to preseason, like you're more than welcome. And I was like, I can't say no. <laughs> now Kelly Hubley to make her NWSL and Portland debut. When Kelly first got here, she was a practice player. She was the type of player that would see no minutes. And that can be a really difficult position for anybody. But what I saw was Kelly really grabbed the moment and the challenge and ran with it. I just wanted to prove to everyone like, I could do this and this is something I wanna do. I really love soccer. I found my love for it again, so I'm gonna try as hard as I can to make the best of it. Kelly Hubley coming on for her second NWSL game. We had all these players where I was just in awe that I get to like watch them and just like learn from them. After my first year, I worked hard every day. I worked out the whole off season because I was gonna come back and earn a roster spot, and I did. And I think for me, it was like climbing this ladder of like, okay, well now, how do I get minutes? Yeah, that's a player we haven't really mentioned. Kelly Hubley getting the start for Portland on the back line. I ended up seeing a sports psych. He really helped me shift my mind to, okay, well, how do I have fun at training while still working hard? Hi, Sam. That was good. And if I'm going to training every day and I'm doing my best to my ability, like, that should be enough for me. And that just, like, really took off for me. Swinger, the header is on, and it's a Splendid service! An even better header! And Portland takes the lead at home! Kelly, as a competitor, is somebody that loves the fight. She loves getting involved in tackles. She loves bopping other players off the ball. Blocked by Hubley. Well done. I like to be aggressive. I like to make tackles. I like to try different things. The tackle by Hubley. She can drive into the midfield and find little passes because when you drive into the midfield, it collapses the defense. Kelly's good at finding the players that have moved and then taking advantage of where they've left. That type of player is really special. Short pass in. Anderson couldn't find it. We're a very close team, which it's pretty rare, I think, to find in professional sports. That's kind of like what's really helped us on the field because when you trust somebody in the locker room, you really trust someone on the field. We spend so much time working on, obviously, our technique and our tactics and on-field things, but we also recognize that one of the most important things that we can do is work on the culture, work on the locker room dynamic. We take things as a team, we go through things as a team. The past couple years have been hard for us, but I think it like drove us to want to win even more because it drew us so much closer as a team. The championship was just amazing. I felt like I was in a dream. Everyone came prepared, persevered through everything we had to deal with. The thorns. Put it away! It all came together in the end, and it was just like really, really cool to be a part of that team. Portland, go celebrate! This night belonged to the Thorns as Portland once again rise to the top of the National Women's Soccer League, winning their record third NWSL championship. I got Iron Woman, played every minute of every game last year. Looking back this year, I'm like, I don't know how I did it. I was just in the grind mode. And then I got second best team, and I couldn't believe it. As a defender, you don't win a lot of awards anyways. My journey has been very hard. It's just shown me there's no ceiling for my growth. 
Flips it ahead to the back post and in from a tight angle. Kelly Hobley opens the scoring for the Thorns. I want to show other people that their path to pro can be completely different. If you want to put in the work, like you can get places and like you can make an impact. Show like younger kids, boys and girls. If you want to play professional soccer, you can. And I didn't have that. So it's just really cool that I can now provide that to the younger generation.